Hi, welcome to the Fleet Feet Running Gear Talks. I'm Jeff, owner and operator of Fleet Feet Richmond, and today we're going to be talking about running shoes. So it's very important to have the right running shoe for your personal comfort and possibility of reducing injuries. Uh, the shoe should be fitted by a reputable running store, such as Fleet Feet. Uh, you should get fitted properly. This involves getting your foot measured, and here at Fleet Feet we do that with our exclusive Fit ID Fit uh, foot scan that measures your foot in all uh, dimensions and compares your foot against the population of fits that we've done nationwide. Expect to wear a shoe that's bigger than your normal street shoe. For example, if you wear a street shoe size 9, more likely you're going to need a running shoe roughly uh, a size 10. The reason for that is you need room for your foot to expand when it strikes the ground. It also swells after miles and miles of running. Expect to have about a 3 8 inch space between the end of your longest toe and the end of the shoe. And the widest part of your foot should be in the widest part of the shoe. It should be neither tight here nor loose. And in this area here, you want a glove-like fit across here, and then you want a nice snug fit in the heel so your heel doesn't slip in and out of the shoe. A shoe will last about three to 500 miles, and you should expect to spend somewhere between $120 and $150 for a good quality shoe. So how do you pick out the right shoe for you? Well, the outfitters at Fleet Feet can help you with that, but what you're looking for is a shoe that fits you comfortably and feels comfortable when you're running. It also should match the biomechanics of your, of your foot itself. The more flexible your foot is, generally the more stiff the shoe you need to have. The more rigid your foot uh, is, typically the more flexible the shoe should be. Shoes should be taken care of, for example, you should avoid pulling your foot out of the shoe with it fully tied up. Always unlace the shoe before you take it off. Uh, if it gets wet, you can stuff newspaper inside of it to let it dry overnight. You should never wash your sh uh, shoes in a machine. You can do it by in hand in a sink with hand soap and a, a good sturdy br uh, nylon brush. And always allow it just to air dry. Avoid it go, uh, being seen in the sunlight because that can damage the uh, plastic materials. A, sh a good shoe that you choose will serve you well, give you comfort on the road, and keep you from getting injured. 